32 gang what's good it's your boy cj on 32s checking in with another video man today guys we is going to be picking up um my son car let y'all know what's going on what happened no y'all ain't seen them in a couple videos lately because he haven't had his car so you know he's he was in an accident most of y'all know and uh he pretty much just been you know laying low-key chilling you know he gotta relax get his head back together and stuff um right now the journey with his car i'm just getting him set up to where he can pretty much roam and do all the modifications do everything he want to do to his car you know i'm just giving him the you know the care package like when you go to the joint the guys ask you what you is and they gonna set you up straight you know until you either get to working or your people seeing you that money shit. so basically that's what i'm doing right now i'm gonna be doing i'm gonna be running around actually and uh i'm about to pick it up from the dealership see what they did which really guys wait till y'all hear the story i'm gonna let i'm gonna let my boy tell y'all the story when we get there because they really ain't do shit so the car been going a week which is probably a good thing because you know things could have always been worse he probably could have been in his car or something but it is what it is man shit happens we still finna keep him on the right track try to keep him motivated i know everything start with me when it comes to my son he look up to me and uh he like being around me so you know no matter how many cups he do uh i gotta be there in this corner you know i love my kids i love them all to death even the ones y'all never seen before uh it is what it is guys you know life when life shit happens it's all about what the hell you doing lady it's all about the comeback man how you react how you gather yourself after mistakes you know you just got to keep it moving ain't nobody in this world perfect everybody make mistakes including myself shit i still be trying to figure out life every day man but you know what i just get up and i push guys tired sleepy it don't even matter i just get up and push because uh if you don't do it nobody gonna get up and do it for you so you gotta do that shit no excuses gang we're gonna have a good day today man hopefully we get a couple laughs we're gonna stop by the shop y'all already know john give us laughs we're gonna go to the interior shop drop the vehicle off i'm trying to have these videos in order because i can't drop this video until after i record his reaction because i'm actually surprising him i'm actually gonna surprise him with the seats you know i got him thinking i'm taking the car but whole time the car been at the dealership trying to get the lights fixed like if you've been following the movement following the videos you would know that um so you know it, it wasn't his car it was actually the rental car but it's all good man you know nobody lost their life and uh it's cold it's slippery it's wet it's icy out here and shit happens man so learning lesson you know hopefully he learned this lesson and i can see change in him it, it just start with me being there so um i appreciate you guys for supporting us through our journey you know uh shit ain't gonna be easy every day man it's life not easy <laughs> life is not easy guys i was actually making a post the other day um i always wonder what it felt like to have a million dollars until i got a million dollars and i'm gonna tell you right now you can buy more with a million dollars, but it's just like having a thousand dollars. You gonna it all spend the same, you know. You got a thousand dollars, and the cost of living and things of living is so high right now. It's like shit. The next minute it's gone. You got a million dollars, it's gone. Like it's not hard to spend a million dollars. It's not a lot of money. It may seem like a lot, but it's not because the more money you make, the more bills you accumulate. Accumulate and you know your lifestyle become more expensive so it's kind of still the same thing yeah you might have more and, and better stuff you know but it's still like the same thing you got to get your ass up you got to grind man so that's why it's important to invest in things i'm not a big investor so i can't give you advice on that but i'm sure there's plenty of people on youtube who can help you i'm not gonna get on here and lie you know i invest in in the shit that i know you know and that's you know cars and little things so I can't give you the rundown and give you no game on that. The only game I can give you is get out here and hustle because there's so many opportunities. I feel like there's more opportunities in the world now than it's ever been before. Trust me, guys. Just get to it. You know, just stop procrastinating. Get to it. Put your phone down. That's another thing. Damn, that shit stink. I'm going to start slowing down on is social media. Like, I got to stay off of the social media, especially like Instagram and Facebook and shit that's not paying me. You know, I do my promotions on there, but I get lost in that shit. I start scrolling and just keep scrolling. Then I start seeing women and start liking 500,000 pictures. Like, I got to just start putting my phone down and get straight to it. I'm more focused when I'm not in my phone, man. But it's just like so much of my life revolves around being in my phone. But, 
know, I just gotta stay sane, guys. So hopefully you can take some of this shit that I'm saying and apply it to your life. If not, man, you know, you know what you're doing. Just keep doing what you're doing, you know? Hey, but anyway, guys, if you're new to the channel, make sure you like, share, subscribe, comment, click that notification bell, and join the 32 gang. And the only way the 32 gang going is up. We made it to the dealership. My boy John is not here right now, so uh, we ain't gonna have him on camera. He don't come back till one o'clock. These guys in here asking me about the Tesla. They really like the Tesla, so I'm gonna stop back by because they got the solar charging stations over here. So, uh, man, hopefully I can get my car charged because it's definitely charging slow over there. But we about to lock up the AMG GT and uh, we about to take the charger, man. Take it over here to the interior shop so I can surprise my son without him pretty much knowing that it's done or anything. I seen y'all comments in the comment section about my tail light on the red eye not being tinted. I don't know how we missed that or what the hell happened, but it's definitely not tinted. You guys are absolutely right. You guys find everything, man. There ain't nothing. I can hide from the 32 gang, but I'm gonna outsmart y'all watch with some of these cars and things I do. I did it with the Challenger, <laughs> but yeah. We got Zay Gold Rush. We just picked it up. Mm-hmm. I think I need the roof, man. I think I'll just put the roof in my red eye. Not in the demon, but I feel like the red eye definitely need that roof. So I'm probably gonna uh, get the roof put in there. It's only like two inches smaller than the factory so i don't care you see when you got the factory paint look at like all the ripples in the paint man it's like you just need to get the whole car wet sand and buff down this is my first drive in this car too actually <laughs> i ain't even driving stuff Let's see what this kid got in here smell already like some strong ass air freshener but the problem was water was going in his lights so they were saying something a waste of time that is not covered under factory blase blase bush bush so um they said when you turn the lights on that it warms up and take the condensation whatever the hell you call it the moisture out the lights so they didn't change the light bulb they just kept it for a damn week to run tests to tell us that so yeah we about to dip off with it though that's three three the hard way get this thing up get up out of here man ain't no paperwork nothing to sign no nothing bro Jeez. i'm gonna come back and get my 63 go get the tesla Take them for a ride, you dick. See how this thing sounding. Now we can get the mid muffler deletes and everything though. That the car back. Can't force him to do nothing. Hopefully he just get motivated, man. How they been driving your stuff? That boy has 749 miles now. Good gosh. <laughs> Zay ain't been playing. Hold on now. Let me see what I can do with this thing. You broke in already, my boy. I just gotta keep them at bay for like two more days, but we got a crazy snowstorm coming. So, um, man, it's gonna be tough. Tough, tough, tough. Ooh, yeah. Little five seven. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Good thing about it though, you know, um, he only 21. And he got a 21. That's paid for. He don't got no notes, so he don't got to worry about nothing. I still see the hate, but it's all good, you know? That's jealousy. You're jealous, man, because you know I can do whatever the hell I want to do. I can go get whatever I want to go get for my kids, and I can go get whatever I want to go get for myself, you know? I work my ass off, and um, I don't hate on nobody. I just try to get somebody a little bit of motivation, some kind of words to just encourage somebody you know i ain't trying to tear nobody down you know that don't make me feel better because i know how i feel to be down all right guys we made it over here to restyling concept man to drop the charger off you know we just gotta wait till it's done over here doing maintenance on this bike
sure this mug don't fall down. Got the support on there. Got some details on here too. Take a look over here at Zay Seats, man. See what we got going on. This is kind of nice. Your doors. Ooh. Yeah, it's gonna look good. Got the door panels. And you got your, your armrest. And... Nice. Nice and simple. Yep. It's perfect for him. Always start him off. Nice. Okay. Bottom. Head rest. Head rest. That's your back arm rest. And I think there's a... There's your center. Mm -hmm. Smell like sharp. Yes, sir. Let me take it out, piece out, and put it by the car so they can see the color contrast with it. It's super close to my color. There's actual leather on the inside. Yeah, let's see it right here. Feel good, too. Mm -hmm. What y'all doing to this? Roof? Yeah. Roof. Let's take it out, guys. See how the color match up alongside the car. Truck seats. Yep, replacing the uh, factory cloth on these ones. Nice. Big gold rush. I want to give them something <coughs> bright that stand out. That's gonna look good. Huh? That's gonna look good. Yeah. Yeah, that's color gonna look real good in there. Real neutral. Kinda wanted us to be twinning it, guys, but you know, hey, super close. Gonna definitely look good. He gonna be happy. Hey, yeah, man. That's gonna look real good. Yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> he said it's gonna look real good. Hey, uh, what do you think you could get me in for a roof? Uh, this week, I gotta wait and see what, uh, what's up with Scott. Scott, man, I know sometimes you'll be watching, man. Get your it's the work, man. Come on, Scott, we need you here. Hey, hey, you know, you know, it's like Shaq and Kobe. We need you here, man. You the man. You the, definitely the man. Yeah, I'm going to wait on Scott. Scott got to cut that top. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's, a, that's a big job. So, yeah, guys, we're leaving Zay car here. Finna get us taken care of. Did uh, Boots interior come yet? Because no, I got it at my shop. I think it's doing uh, tomorrow. Doing tomorrow. So right after we finish with Zay Gold Rush, we got um, Big Boot J Car coming in. They pretty much let me pick out the design and pretty much do what I want to do. Shout out to my guys, man. Marty Mart, I'm taking care of his wheels, so I'm pretty much, he said I can do what I want to do. I told him that's the deal. If I'm paying for the wheels, I got to do it my way, you know, my vision. So shout out to them guys, man. You know, I had a bad day yesterday. I was going to get Jay on camera, but it was just a bad day man i lost the last key to my bins yesterday to end up finding it it was horrible and it was cold so let them know where they can find you at if they need anything done uh 815-729-1819 joliet illinois 301 airport drive joliet That's illinois a restyling concept guys and you know I don't trust a lot of people around my vehicles or with my vehicles, so if I'm bringing my vehicles here, y'all definitely know that I trust them, especially cutting roofs and shit in, in the car. You know, if you go on a review page, you'll see pretty much got five-star views across the across the board. Let me check out that roof one more time. Sure. It, it was like two inches off from the stock, right? Uh, well, I'll tell you what. Let's, let's grab this and put it on your car. Where's the wife today? 
Ah, she's outspending money. Spending the money, hey. <laughs> Why was, the, hey, you took, the, bro, you took the words right out of my mouth. I swear I was gonna say that. What you doing? I was spending the money. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you're, you're an inch on each side. Yeah, it ain't nothing. You know, once we put it in, that's gonna be it. No complaining. It's just curved more. It's got a more of a bow up. Bow, yeah. So what this one do right here? It goes back or? Yeah, you know, I've got one that actually, uh, yeah, it tilts up, closes, and then goes back. So it goes back, like back here? Inside. Oh, go inside. inside. That's the one I like. That's the one you're getting? Yeah, the inside one. Yeah. And the, we have oh. some that, uh, this one actually just, uh, just tilt up. This one doesn't auto close, but I've got some that auto close. Okay. With the key, so we'll put that one in for you. All right, yeah, because on the scat pack, we had the one that went all the way, the two that went all the way back. Yeah. yeah, I don't like them. I like the one that go in better. You know, th those are nice, but I don't know, they're more of a gimmick, you know. Their, their quality wasn't quite there like, like this one. Um, they're discontinued now anyway. Oh, they discontinued them? Yeah, nobody can get them. Damn. Hey, man, you got that scat pack. You better be careful out there. <laughs> you said you can't get them no more. Here you go. All so right. anybody interested in a roof, like what's the turnaround on like a roof? Uh, two days normally. We start getting busy around the end of February. Uh, we back up two to three weeks. Uh, sometimes less. I can never predict, but... And the turnaround on like if they want to get custom seats? Uh, it takes about two weeks to uh, for the kit to arrive and then we do the job in two days. Okay, and what's the warranty on the sunroof? So everybody uh, the knows. The sunroof is lifetime warranty on parts mm -hmm. and uh, the interiors are three years. Three years, all right. All right, man, we got us one coming, guys. You know, hopefully you can stay in and be busy. We got a crazy snowstorm coming. Oh, that's right. Yeah, so it's gonna be hard to, uh, if it's snowing bad, you know these drive horrible when the snow is not gonna be a pickup. Well, we'll just keep it inside. Yep. Oh, you gotta keep these inside, you know, number one stolen cars right now. We do. All they do is steal, steal, steal. <laughs> Don't steal this one though. Go get all the more parts you want. <laughs> Cause I ain't buying two years to But yeah, guys, uh, I'm gonna chop it up, finish up with him. And no, hey, Junior, we got you. We got you here, man. We're going to get you right. Just wait on them wheels to come now. I don't know how much longer the wheels going to take. And then uh, I'm probably going to bring the red out here. No, I'm not probably. I'm going to bring the red out here as soon as he get it open. We're going to put a roof in there. We're not going to put a roof in the Demon. But I just feel like the red, I got to have that roof. So stay tuned. We got Bob with us. And we is taking Bob inside the 32 Game Clubhouse. I don't think he ready for what he about to see in here. And he gave me a ride. So I definitely appreciate the ride. Oh, I got a million keys. I'm gonna pull that Tesla out. I feel like driving it, man. I don't know why. Like, guys, when I'm behind the wheel, that just do something different to me. It give me a feeling that I ain't had in a long time since I got my Aventador. You ready, Bob? Check out the clubhouse. Some lights on around here. All right, this is the clubhouse. This is the Tesla. What's behind the wall? Car wash side. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Bob just cussed. You know he must like it. How much charge I got? Oh, I'm at 200 miles now. Still ain't charged. I'm gonna still put it on that supercharger over there. <laughs> Look at that roof. Glass. This is nice. I like the color. White seats. Look at the key. Uh, yeah. It's nice, man. Here's J car right here. Just gonna put the red seats in. This is my car, I need the roof in. See? 
Damn, his his interior looks just like that now, don't it? Mm -hmm. Pretty much. Yeah, this is all factory stock right here. Red Eye, 797 horsepower. That's my Demon I just got out the paint shop. I painted it to match this one. It's a factory color gold rush. I got this back like two days ago. This is the rare Dodge Demon. Yeah, the whole car painted. 840 uh, horse. Yep, it was red. Oh yeah, you know every single part of the car is painted. Engine bay to every single yeah, that wasn't yeah I don't play around. Nah. Everything's painted on this bad boy. To match. I like them in pairs. I like my women in pairs. This is my I8 roaster. I just got this. Um, I love this thing. This is going to Dallas. This is my car for Dallas right here. Top left back, convertible. Can't drive it and enjoy it here. Can't enjoy shit here. They always ask why I don't drive the cars. I can't. I don't know, my track hawk. You got custom white interior. My red eye, this is leaving. I'm picking the winner for this today. You have this painted? Yeah. White, uh, white with pearls. These two match each other. Hellcat Durango, I only got like 200 miles on this. None of the cars got miles on them. This one got like 1,400. This one got 200. The Demon got 5,000. My Escalade, 21. Yeah. This matched my vet. My C8, the same color. And my big boy Dooley right here. Whole car was took apart. This one I'm leaving black stock. It's got some big red Forgiatos. You ever see the inside of one of these? This? Yeah. Well, depends what you do to it. Nah, I ain't do nothing. It's just, it's stocked with oh, yeah, top. We do these yeah. all the time. Do them all the time? Big ass screen in there. Yeah. Same with the Ford. Yeah, not that many miles on this one either. 3,000. Never drive it. Yeah. Big Red. That's what we call it. Big Red. You know, kind of the red playoff of... Yeah, yeah I didn't, I'm going to haul my cars, but I didn't buy it for the purposes most people buy a dually for. That shit ain't going to make me no money. I'm not moving houses and shit. I'm driving around with my arm out the window. Big Red. Big Boy Rigs. Just think about the clubhouse, man. Nice. Nice. Appreciate it. No, ain't no fancy 1950 mobiles in here, but hey, man, we got a good selection of a new school, custom new school. Pretty much everything custom in here. Well, I like the Durango. You I like the Durango? I'll take the Durango. <laughs> it got red in the inside, too. Does it? Yeah. It was black when I bought it. Well, hey, man. Can't complain. Blessings. Home blessings. The grind don't stop. So we doing the red eye. We doing the we doing the Camaro first and then the red eye roof. Or Okay, Camaro. No, I'm asking you how you want to oh, do whatever it. Whatever you want. I can get both in at once. Okay. Whatever you work for you. Whatever worked best for you. Just let me know and I'm over there. Appreciate it. Deal. Gonna go slide around in this bad boy right here. The newest member. Alright, take care. Alright, man, guys, we finna slide and head over. Should we go to the shop or should we go to the dealership? Probably go to I don't know. <laughs> Stop being lying. Shop flow, shop flow, y'all know what time it is, gang. Long as I'm here, I ain't missing a day without going to neither shop. Cars over there, family over here. You get it? Yeah, you get it. And it really ain't much else to do around this month anyways, man. It's so damn cold. Can't go downtown, can't kick it, so why waste the drive, man? Try to make the best out of the shit I got around here. About to be getting some races in, too. Got to race that Tesla against uh some of my guys, man. Hellcats. All that good stuff. Good content. I want to do it. I want to put it to the test. 
And we're gonna be taking hella people for rides. I need women now, though. Marty Mar, man, I'ma need you. Tell the women, man. We finna pile up in there and go on this Tesla uh, crazy driving. My boy, my boy Al. Look what like up? He, kinda look like he had a rough day looking over there. All I see is your forehead Plus, peeking tell up. Tell marketer calls about my comment bill, and then I hang up on him. I said, we're not on, do not call us. And then he calls back, and he's like, I'm not trying to sell you something. I'm of like, course he's gonna call back. <laughs> Dude, what's going on around here, man? Pretty good knows everything. Chillin', chillin', chillin' like a villain. Come to check you guys out. I don't see nothing new. Mighty Quack. Ooh. I never seen these. This is a, one of the new ones. Look at that. Blank. Ooh. Yeah, that one nice. Mm -hmm. It comes also in black on that one. Uh, we got the RTX wheels. So I think which one do we show? That one, right? I think so. Check out this one. This is Ooh, like that a, one nice too. Uh, graphite color. Uh, so if you guys, uh, any of you guys want, these are rotary forces. And these are a little better priced. Uh, so they're the lightweight wheels. You got like a cap cap on there. <laughs> Pretty dope. I like that. That's a nice clean wheel. You got that one, and then we got this black and red one. Too. Ooh, damn! I thought that was a BMW sign right there. So we stop the cap. Those are false advertising. Those are uh, specifically for BMWs. Uh, okay. I sold them this one. That's another RTX wheel. Yeah. Oh, you showed them this one? Yeah. I can't hear it. Well, I yes, wanted sir. stuff with the pops more with the different colors on there, so. Right. Yes. Well, you got it. Did you sell them Ruchis? Were they still over there? Uh, which Ruchis? Yours? No, they ain't mine. <laughs> the CJ on 32s? No, them ain't no CJ on 32s. <laughs> I, mean, I took the cap off, though. I see they got a. Yeah, I got the floating caps on there, too, so. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh shit. Oh boy, I thought this was a black chrome. It don't look chrome. It is, a black chrome. It is ain't it? Yeah. Check this one out, guys. No, I don't remember seeing this one. Black chrome. Um, I like I black chrome. Know, it just looks by so 120 good. for like Camaros. Uh, oh, this would have worked on the Tesla. On the Tesla. Yeah, that's a nice a wheel. Miles, so 22 by 10s. I got them in uh, 5 by 120 and 5 by 112 for like Mercedes, Mercedes. and stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. All right, guys. We loaded up, man. I know they pushing them taxes back, but you know what I'm saying? We do financing too. Yeah, we got about we got about 20 sets that came in from Lexani. I think we them off these, right? Uh, I think, I think I pretty much showed them. These guys set up the other rack. The Stuttgarts, those uh, for chargers, 300s, Magnums. Uh, this one's for like box Caprices, two five by 120, Camaros too. That's six lug. Yeah, I see that six lug right there. I don't know what that is. A little rotisserie <laughs> roll go. They got burnt a little bit too much. Holy shit, what the hell we got here? We got more stuff. Here, you want to hold this real quick? Let's do a quick oh, unboxing game. Which car do you got today? My wife's like, what the hell's back there? Where? <laughs> oh, oh, this Your is stuff. Oh, damn. Listen, if you're watching the video, I'm going to get everything up out of here. <laughs> Matter of fact, Al, because we're doing the giveaway tonight at 7 when you get off work. Oh, I can bring, bring all this stuff. Yeah, we're going to get it out of here. Al told me leave it, so I just thought it was okay to leave. <laughs> we haven't had... Ooh. Let me clean your lens. I think it's a little dirty on there. It's like a little fuzzy. I don't know if it's Yeah, work. we don't do no cutting out. Hold on. Let's Let me see. see. Before we get to this merch, he said it's a little fuzzy. That means I've been recording that fuzz the whole damn time. That's all right. We're going to get it done. My boy. What's the word, man? Just wanted to come back here to fire you. That's all. Yes, sir. Just clock out at 6 o'clock, okay? I got it. We don't care nothing about no 6 o'clock, right? We on owl time. So we got a new tool. Our breaker bar actually broke. The big one? That's a big one. Ooh, off-road wheels. Blame the black man, of course. Of course, right? Yep. <laughs> it's the other way around. Guilty and never proven innocent. All right, man. Check it out. We got this from Foolin', the Foolin' Company. So, Los Angeles shirt, say Foolin'. Big boobs. Yeah, medium. <laughs> I thought I got blue. Oh, yeah, it do got some boobs on it. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> And let me make sure all this for me before I, oh, it's all in medium, so she guessing. Oh, see. you got a belt and everything. 
at Foolin' Forever. I design merch. I live near Dallas. If you need help making clothing, I got you. So make sure y'all go check him out. I don't know where this at Foolin' Forever is at. Maybe that's his Instagram. Y'all can check him out here. He make clothing. Hey, man. Yeah, let's check you out then, my boy. Okay. Hold on. Hold on, my boy trying to really have me fooled. <laughs> there you go. Kind of dope concept, though. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Man, objective. definitely appreciate it, man. This is 32 for 32 game. You know my size and all, man. But sometimes, you know, you got to try jeans on because sometimes they just fit different. You buy your size and sometimes I'm going to be like this. Be like, hey! <laughs> Go big, then you got the loop. So it's, hey, man, she you can't know. control what they got going on for this generation. Ooh, man, he got the belt too. My boy popping, ain't he? Oh, yeah. You fool it, fool. <laughs> Appreciate it. Nice, good leather belt to beat my ass with. <laughs> Maybe I better give it to Al because I think he needed more. <laughs> yeah, for Johnny. Got another fooling shirt. Check him out, man. That just came in today. Appreciate it. Definitely mm -hmm. appreciate it, guys. If you're trying to send merch, that's 2409 West Jefferson Street. I wear a size medium and t shirts. And I wear an extra 30, large, and BJ wears a double X. 30, 32 in jeans, <laughs> and 10 in Air Force One, 10 and a half in other shoes. But, you know, just in case anybody <laughs> was cool. wondering. Then all it needs is the numbers on the back, and you'd be back in prison. Yeah. <laughs> well, I wasn't in the, I wasn't back in them days when they was wearing the stripes. My boy, <laughs> get it right. We put on our blues. Our <laughs> yeah. <All the> blues. <laughs> yeah. They all got jokes today, huh? <laughs> now, if I stink him, y'all gonna say, "Oh, CJ, why you punch Al in the nose and have his nose bleed?" Because he was talking. Sh he was disrespecting. Ooh. Now we got the foolie hoodie. Oh, wow. Ooh. That's a lot of colors. Some all white. I know, right? Gotta make your shit if you wanna be. Oh, look, hold on. This is what Al need. <laughs> oh, yeah, when we driving, zip his ass right up so his mouth shut. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. This is perfect for That's Al. It's a medium. Man, I don't care. As long as this fit over your head and you can zip it up and shut the hell up, man. <laughs> Perfect. So thank you, man. Appreciate you once again, guys. You can follow Foolin' Forever. I guess that's his Instagram. He didn't say much. We got one more box here from Adrian Walton out of Memphis, Tennessee. Let's see what you got going on here, my boy. I don't know where my tricky knife is, so they done stolen and put this uh <laughs> put this crazy knife in here. As long as they get the job done. This unboxing done. I'm gonna leave early to make sure Al packs this up and bring it by itself. We're gonna put it uh in the basement by the door. Oh man, nice. I'm gonna tell you he's gonna be the winner, right? Hold on, man. What you got in here, boy? You trying to blow me up? You got a bomb or something in here? Adrian <laughs> Walton, Instagram. I smell it. He got some scents up in here. Oh, check him out. It's clear. Yeah. Got me digging through stuff. Oh, hold on. Is this the same place that sent us the smell goods? Yeah, definitely bring all this tonight. <laughs> Dang. You use all those candles, huh? Bro, I ain't use them yet. <laughs> smell it. You trying to pick it up? Put your nose in it. I can't share these, y'all. Yeah. Al, you get none of these. <laughs> Keep your dog smell. <laughs> You got a couple of candles in there, Keep right? your dog smell. You ain't gonna light one up around here. <laughs> you can light it up. You gonna light one up? All right, we're gonna give Al one. We're gonna be generous today. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Appreciate it, man. Appreciate everybody who send us stuff to the shop, man. It's greatly appreciated. Greatly gonna get put to use. Appreciate the clothes from uh, Foolin'. Foolin' forever. Appreciate it, man. You know what I'm saying? Probably see my kids rocking this. Not your boy CJ on 32s, rocking everything now, the pants and stuff. You know, they younger, they in the high school, so they can rock this type of stuff. But I wear the white and black shirt, and I definitely wear the blue shirt, and I definitely appreciate it, man. At least you made the channel. You know, you, you got a lot of people in the world that get to see your merchandise, so if you send me stuff, guys, I'm going to put it on the channel, man. Definitely appreciate it.
BJ! Why your shoes dirty? <laughs> That's right. Gotta get the torch for your candle. Yeah, we know what you use that for, your pipe. When you get high. <laughs> Al gonna set the whole building on fire. There we go. That's what I, Let me see. 32 game. Take a sniff. <laughs> Ooh, strong. Damn. Very nice. Man, smell good. Smells good. Yeah, you need these in the shop. I know. This dude be paying spraying a whole damn gallon of Febreze in here. You come in here, you sneezing, you can't even breathe. It just fumes all over the place. There's certain customers that walk in that have. <laughs> Man, bro, can't nobody get an instant headache. Your ass walk in here, you just suck up the whole damn can of Febreze, Febreze up your nose. I gotta, I gotta get that oxygen that they give in Las Vegas that makes you uh, purchase stuff. Yeah, yeah, probably that, yeah, come in here. Yeah, say somebody send them one of them candles that light up. That smell like a little twin twin twin. The incense I got Oh, you got some smoky smoke smoke? Shit, don't worry, we need the incense. BJ will fired up back here quick, huh? Let it flow to the front. <laughs> That's why I keep the door closed, but she's not saying. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But anyway, guys, man. Hey, this your boy CJ on 32s. Checking out with another video. I'm out, man. Gang. They know in my city lately, I've been on their ass. In a way that I've been living, I just hope that I don't crash. Even though I put you first, you the one that put me last. And that shit don't even hurt because I moved on from the past. You know that it's true, you see what I do. I got Gucci on my back, Dior down on my shoes. Even though my bitch is bad, I don't know who to choose. Thinking I'ma take her back, bitch, you must be a fool. Yeah, yeah. This shit so crazy, I done made it out I'm really living all the days I would pray about All I had to do was stay in my lane and just stand around Any nigga try to get in my way, we gon' lay him down